This lesson is meant to be a quick officer overview on the many uses of MUMS. Not only does MUMS assist with the ATU month-end processes of the yellow sheet, white sheet, pink sheet, green sheet, blue sheet, and monthly cover sheet, MUMS also helps locals accomplish organizing grievances and political action. Let me show you samples. I'm clicking the little person walking. I'm finding the guy named Reed, Alton Reed. Here on the basic membership tab, we keep track of the most important thing, status codes. Status codes are for members. There are status codes for retirees. There are status codes for external organizing targets. It is the use of status codes, the most important field of mums. If I move in to here, I can see I have home, work, and cell phone numbers. If I move to the work tab, I can keep track of multiple job titles, different employers, and different work locations, both useful in internal and external organizing. If I go into the other tab, I can keep track of political districts, political parties, voting histories, all used for the get out the vote activities so important to our legislative and political goals. If I go into the union codes tab, I can keep track of committees, activities, helps me keep track of attendance, notes, I can write any note that I need to write. The financial tab allows me to keep track of wages for purposes of negotiating collective bargaining agreements in history. If I was posting dues on a monthly basis, you would see it. I can come down here to grievances. I can look at a grievance. Here I'm looking at grievance number five on Alton Reed. I know it's an open grievance. I know when something is going to happen next, and it's supposed to come out of recess very soon. Mums does not try to eliminate the grievance folder. Mums tries to card categorize the significant events. Because with Mums, every field is selectable, is sortable, and outputable. There are a number of reports that have been written in Mums. I'm going to do labels. I'm doing labels for my active members. I'm hitting the run button, and here's a list of labels for my active members. I'm going up to reports, standard reports, grievance reports, a list of my open grievances, and I see a list of my open grievances and date sequence. I'm going to reports, standard reports, member reports, member list, where people work. A member roster is where people live. A phone list is so helpful for organizing purposes, showing me the home and work phone numbers. Again, every field of mums is selectable, sortable, and outputable, and we will cover all of those topics in additional frequently asked question video clips. Thank you. This concludes this lesson, a quick overview.